what's up guys welcome to youtube so guys i'm gonna be so i'm gonna be talking about the samsung galaxy m21 volume 3 upgrade so uh, so from the previous month uh, the samsung was uh, so it was running in android 10 there was no update and the one way 3 upgrade list was in march so i expected that it would receive an ota update of android 10 only but after after all it received android 11 on 27 jan as you can see it's running on android 11 with one ui 3.0 core so uh, as you can see it's running uh, so the settings layout has been changed and it has been made easier than the one ui 2.5 and as you can see all the icons and uh, the samsung account toggle has been changed in this and so the on the front screen as you can see the widget has been changed and the launcher ui in the launcher we get a uh, effect blur that's of android 11 blur that we also get a notification panel and as you can see it's the new one ui launcher and at the lock screen there is an another change of the layout and lock screen as you can see the icons have been changed the layout and the buttons have been changed so yeah so the performance after the one ui 3.0 upgrade the performance has been increased and it has been more uh, so it has been more better than much better than in uh, RAM management before and the gaming also now I did test the Geekbench benchmarks now I'm gonna be not showing you but I see that there was a difference in scores and also some of the optimization has been done in M21's upgrade and I am not feeling like now after like seven days I am receiving that another navigation bar problem gestures problem that was there on Android 10 and I have, I have, I have seen in uh, many phones like i have seen in many phones so yeah but uh right now when you're scrolling or as you can see it's working smoothly and 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 the fingerprint scanner has, speed has been increased and the face unlock has been working good so yeah. now as you can see so now now the settings lot and all have been changed but the device care widget has been changed a lot and as you can see inside if you get and search for the battery and inside the battery is it has been changed and as you can see you get the uh, different layout of usage and even in storage option you can get you can see it so yeah now the second thing is that in if you will go to my files option now if you will search so you will get a new option called recycle bin like for example i delete any file let me show you so like i am deleting this image so if i will delete the, this image so as you can see you can get it from the recycle bin back so yeah uh, so the recycle bin we get in the gallery option but not in the previously we uh, get the button not in the internal storage options and all so yeah you can get your photos back and all. so i think so this is the most useful feature like many times it has happened i have deleted a file and i cannot found it anymore and i think so the blur looks cool now now the smoothness and all is great but now two new two new features has been added to the one ui 3.0 so the so in one ui 3.0 now we get edge panel so the edge panel was provided in the full ui one ui version like it's running on one ui core so in previously on uh, one ui 2.5 there was no edge panel nothing and right now they have added the edge panels and so here we have the edge panel that we used to get in the full one UI. Now we can get in the core uh, one UI core also. Now you can you can select which toggles you want. Like I'm selecting all the toggles, and then as you can see, if you will scroll so yeah, scroll so yeah. Now there is no screen recorder uh, added, so that is that is fine with it, and I think so that's that's okay. And we get the pop up notification one. Like if you will go to the status bar and brief so we get the edge lighting features and all so that looks great now if you will switch to the dark mode like the uh, blur and all and blur and all is working smooth and uh, and the performance and all but i think so now it's running on one year january 2021 patched and so i think so the phone is working fine and uh, the most and the second feature is the call uh, background feature like if i will uh, go to the call background feature and then so as you can see this is a, you can change your call background like i want to change my call background so 
yeah and the camera op uh, optimization has been improved and i think so the, the phone like uh, the performance has been increased but uh, the rebooting speed has been somewhat increased like from the one u 2.5 like i was comparing with uh, several phones and which is used to boot faster but now the the headphones are boost booting fa uh, faster now the notification panel as you can see these these features has been changed and i think so that it's working fine and it looks more cleaner than before but now as you can see we have so yeah now now there's an option in so the if you will go to the widget option now you have to tap like this so you can change so this is also a change now the charging battery is working fine and the charging speed is also the same but yeah now the camera stability is great and i think so that it's a great update so so thanks for the video guys please subscribe my channel and like my video